Welcome to the Industrial Security Services. Today we would like to deal with an exciting and brand new topic. How can industrial anomaly detection be embedded into the concept of defense in depth based in the IEC 62443? Here we have applied a simplified concept displaying a factory with two S7-1500 within one network cell. But there are diverse potential threats which have to be fought against with specific measures. A Scalance S security appliance provides cell protection here. In addition, a PLC has been subject to different hardening measures in order to make it more resistant against attacks. We show two potential attack scenarios. One, a denial of service attack from outside of the cell. And two, a man in the middle attack from within the cell. In addition to the automation components in the cell, we have included the industrial anomaly detection solution offered by the Industrial Security Services. It monitors the entire network traffic of the automation cell using the mirror ports of the switches without having to interfere with the automation. This enables the following. One, based on the network traffic, we identify all parties involved in detail. What PLCs are available, what serial number, what software and hardware status do they have, what HMI are available, and what other automation components. Two, we also see the communication between the devices, who communicates with whom and what exactly is talked about. Three, we can also identify simple and complex things on this basis. This might be attacks, such as a man in the middle attack, or changes to the configuration, PLC start and stop commands. This helps us identify changes to the automation components, which in return allows for immediate action. All this is made passively, without a direct impact on the factory, and is thus an ideal add-on to the Defense in Depth concept. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.